Tonight's story is something to really sink your teeth into. Welcome to Urban Legends. Megalodon, which means big tooth, was a type of mackerel shark that lived in the world's oceans up to 3.6 million years ago. Recent estimates put the animal's max size at an intimidating 67 feet long and 103 metric tons. The animal is thought to be extinct, dying out as the waters turned too cold for it to survive in. There are those however that think otherwise. The megalodon was one of the largest predators that's ever existed. It lived in temperate, tropical and subtropical waters. This enormous animal ate whales, dolphins, sea lions, turtles and large fish. Only the Liviatan, which was similar to a sperm whale, would have rivaled it. In 1878, the crew of HMS Challenger found a pair of megalodon teeth while dredging the seabed near Tahiti. These have been studied over the years, and most estimates say they are between 10 and 15,000 years old, yet science says that the animal became extinct several million years ago. In 1942, a group of German army boats were about to set sail from a port in Cape Town, South Africa, when the crews reportedly spotted a shark so big that the gap between its dorsal fin and caudal fin was estimated to be 65 feet. Not even the biggest type of shark, which is the whale shark has measurements of that scale, In 2021, beachgoers were surprised to see a large carcass washed up on a shore in South Africa, but this was no ordinary carcass, it was that of a blue whale, the largest animal on earth. It had been bitten in half. All reports seem to agree that it had certainly been attacked by a predator, but blue whales are not known to be preyed upon by anything known to man. Most famous of them all, is the black demon, also known as El Demonio Negro, which is said to be over 50 feet from nose to tail, and has terrified fishermen in the Sea of Cortez for many years. In 2008, American sport fisherman Eric Mack encountered an enormous creature that fitted the description of the Black Demon. Afterwards, he assembled a film crew to accompany him back to the area, but they could not find it. Whale carcasses with giant bite marks regularly wash up on the local shores, and most people believe that this huge shark is responsible. According to the Guinness Book of Records, the largest Great Whites measured in at 36 feet long in South Australia in the 1870s, and 37 feet long in New Brunswick, Canada in the 1930s. Presently, the largest known Great White is nicknamed Deep Blue, who is around 20 feet long. Numbers of Great Whites are starting to rise, due to bans on hunting them in many areas of the world, and a deeper understanding of them, and their habits, putting to rest the outdated theory that they are just mindless killing machines. Many sightings of the Megalodon may well just be actual sightings of large Great Whites, that would have resembled the Megalodon, despite being smaller. The two teeth found and dated only a few thousand years old would however signify that these giants may or may recently have inhabited the ocean still, but until further testing is carried out or other concrete evidence is found, this will remain a theory. That concludes tonight's story. I'll see you next time for more urban legends.